Hello, welcome back to the Banner Saga. Yeah, last time we've come, so today let's rest. Now our, now our hurt guy is well, and I guess we can leave. Yeah, it's been uh, some time since the last time I launched the game. Weather fell. Even the name means bad weather, where frozen wind sweeps in from the bay. They tend livestock, but most are just men driven from strand with nowhere else to go. Why else would anyone stay? We won't stop long. Okay, if you say so, we don't really have any reason to stay for long unless they are in some kind of trouble, I guess. By Hardenberg, that's a lot of Val for some missing cattle. What? A couple days back, sent word to Strand about the cattle. Didn't expect an army. He looks pleased with himself until it sinks in that you aren't here for his be on his behalf. Where have your cattle gone? You didn't know my boy seamen up the hills carrying them away. Don't know many men who can hoist a whole cow by himself. Scalflings out here, maybe? Could they have barrel walking for them? Not from what the governor told me. I'm going to take a look around and get camp set up. The peasant spits, his eyes anxiously darting about as the caravan sets up tents. We'll be here no more than a day. There's silver for any food you've got. For hundreds of varl? Are you serious? Whatever you're willing to sell. You thinking of squatting? Not enough room for a couple hunters here. Forget hundreds of. Shut up. Get up. We're slowing. It's faint. Sounds like fighting and something else. Hakon takes off at the run. Maybe he found the cattle thief. I hope not. Of course. Oh. Okay. You can detail automatically made the cut path, but you can also set waypoints. Click once to make a set. Of. Now select the, new, the next waypoint. This often is when you need to avoid certain tiles. Okay. Spearman can attack diagonally and up to two tiles away. Okay. <laughs> armor blocks attack of strength. For each enemy armor higher than your strength, there is a 10% chance the attack will be deflected. Notice the chance to hit shown above the attack button. Why do you want me to attack me? Can I? And I can't even raise it. Deflected attacks do, do no damage. From here on out, you will fail catastrophically if you don't break armor. Damaging more strength and armor is equally important. Okay, well, he could move over here. No, he only could attack. Wait, you have 9, you have 14, you have 7, so I surely want to. Attack him and destroy four of his armor. Let's go big. We really need to do that. You only have seven. So you will try killing him. No, oh, four damage is four damage he gets taken. Yep. Yeah. On him. Uh, let's destroy his armor a bit. Oh no no no, please don't die. Okay. Uh, once again, do four points of damage. Don't. He can't hit diagonally, right? Um, Tempest will hit him too. Do not. No. Actually, I want you to run away, although they will 
Uh, but he will kill you. I'm fully sure of that. Can I see how... nope, I can't... wait. I can't see how far. I can go up to two tiles away. So if... it will be... like here. So if I move over, let's say here, we should be safe. And then... Nope! I... I can't read properly. The guy will die. Oh, he will be hurt. Okay, he can die. Oh, no, you cannot do Tempest. Can you bring the pain? Basically, me almost pushes enemies forward. I want to see that. Two. Okay. You can kill him. Well, uh, or you can kill. Ah, uh, they're both. Actually, do that because he has to go all the way around. When an enemy falls in battle, one willpower star is added to your horn. Using the horn, give one willpower to. Okay. Okay, then. Uh, okay, you can kill him. Okay. Okay, I can give full power. Thank you. No, you only use one. Go for his armor. He will kill him. Oh, and he's promoted. Nice. My renown grows. Nice. Wall master. Okay. Shield master. And there's that one guy that's hurt. Yeah, he's been injured and we just healed him. I don't think he's gaining any experience. You're trying to get yourself killed, Luden? What are you doing? I was trying... finding... trying to get a shot in between the plates. You never seen a dredge before, boy? What kind of idiot? Break their armor first. Where did they come from? We didn't even see them. They were just there. Hakon goes to where Vognir lies face down. The future Varl King lies motionless, aside from a spreading pool of blood. Vognir is dead. Chapter 2 Cut with keen edged sword. Where did that thing come from? Shh, stay close. I, I think it saw us. I'm gonna regret giving her that voice. I'm I already I'm already re regretting it. Deployment happens before battle. Click your units, Rook and Alet. To deploy them within the blue squares, quick ready. Well, I think, well, she has a bow and he has a bow. So I guess this is gonna be. Mm, click in spotter to see information about his abilities. Mark prey does armor break, damage all others within range, attack. Okay. But he can only attack. Okay. An orange square indicate the range of the unit's attack. Archer, like Rook and Aled, have much longer range. Okay, but I guess we're not gonna. Move. Let him. And this one. For the needle hits, all units between the archer and the target, doing bonus armor damage. No, you wait as well. As well. And please tell me you can hit him. For two. I forgot he moves. 
twice in a turn. Okay. Wait, what? Okay, you can only shoot. So let's go like this and get his armor down. Rook will hit him, hopefully. Okay. Throw a lot. That's two turns of getting rid of his armor. And he can do anything else right now. Alette looks calm, but you can tell her heart is about to beat right out of her chest. It was. Let me see. Are you hurt? No, I'm... I'll be fine. When the dredge attacked your cart and the yoke's bolted, it spilled most of your supplies. You can see more dark figures moving through trees when you glance that direction. Oh, that food. That's the last we're going to get before winter. Do we... What do we do? Don't run. Let me think. If... Do you think we can handle more of them? Or if we ever can gather them before more? Yeah. Let's get as many as we can. I can see them in the trees. Are you sure about this? No. We have to try. Be quick. Alette calms the ox while you frantic frantically toss supplies back into the cart. More threat emerge, but you manage to get the cart moving again before they can close in. The colossal figures slowly recede into the distance. Supplies represent food and other goods used to keep everyone alive on the road. When supplies are gone, people start to die of starvation. The more people are in the caravan, the faster supplies will diminish. You can see how many days of supplies you have left on the travel display at the top of the screen. Most town will have supplies to sell, as well as a few items. Well, 18 was a lot for the two of them. So I don't feel that bad about it. between the trees as we approach our home, and Alette grips my hand tight. We must find Ivor. Oh, no. <laughs> the enormous Varl in question towers over the man in the trading field. He squints as you approach. Already back, Huntmaster? Though you'll be tomorrow. Dredge! Everywhere! Dredge? How did they get through Greyhorn? Must have broken through the fort. The fighters nearby have stopped sparring. They got around you. Damn it! We'll be here soon if they're not already. You hear screams from the outskirts, people are running toward the Great Hall. Ivor turns to one of the older boys in his group of fighters. Egil, take a lead to the Great Hall. Tell the chieftain what's happening. The rest of you gather up as many people as you can. Come on, Alet. No, wait, I, I want to help. Let them fight. 
Why not invite some goats to join us too? We're asking for dead kids. I won't let anything happen to her. They'll have to deal with it sooner or later, either. Ivor. What now? <laughs> Egil, keep your shield up. We just hold them off until everyone's inside. Then we figure out what to do next. More shouts draw your attention to some houses atop a nearby hill. Oh, we can actually see the raiders in the foreground. Sure enough, the dredge are gathering in number. Fear threatens to bubble over into panic. How long do we need to keep this up? You ask. Ivar shakes his head unknowingly. That's a bad sign. Okay, so we have deployed everyone we can and this is... Alet's bracelet, lovingly made by a hunter's wife to keep her daughter safe from harm. Can give, yep, and we can give it to her. Oh no, 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 she's not gone. She won't be dead. You get over here. I want you up front and you over here. Now we are ready. Go for the armor. Can you hit him? No, you cannot. Yeah, I knew it, and I still haven't do it. You to stay, stand here. Okay, you cannot hit. Ah, move. Nope, don't enter. Do it. Hit him. Four. Oh, it's the big one's done. Okay, he doesn't hit that hard, but he has 16 armor. Okay. Can you push him? Battering ram. No, he's already back. Multiple times in armor. No, 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 no. no. Just kill him. Go for his armor, really. Only he. Oh no, no, is she dead? No. But nearly. God damn it, I really hoped he wouldn't stand here. Okay, she. Needs to go back over here, just like this. She can't hit him. Oh, she can go for another armor break. But he shouldn't be able to hit her if I. Yep, I got that right. And he stands right where I wanted him to. That doesn't really matter. We should help him as well. Okay, they are fine, I think. He's after this guy, so yeah. We'll do this first. Okay, oh no. Okay, everything's fine. That's stone wall. Get his armor down. And he should be dead. He should be able to kill him, yep.
but I'm sh fairly sure that our that Ivar got every kill. <laughs> Combat can be unforgiving. Don't hesitate to change the difficulty of battle if it leaves you frustrated or you find yourself needing a tougher challenge. Use the options menu to change difficulty. Don't worry, you can change the difficulty at any time. It and it has no effect on the story or the choices you make. A black horde is forming at the tree line. Enough of this, says Ivor, glancing over his shoulder. We're going back, and adds, Rook, I'm doing one more check of the houses around here. See if you can find anyone. Okay. As you turn to head back, a colossus appears around the side of a house. It silently looms over Alet, its face an expressionless, stony mask, more terrifying than any roar it may have produced. Time seems to slow as it pulls back its enormous maze. Shout at her. You scream at its name. She snaps to attention, confused, but no, does not dive out of harm's way as you had imagined in your head. Suddenly, Idril is between the dredge and Alet, his shield above him. The black stone maze falls. Idril's shield crumples, and so does the boy beneath it. A moment later, Ivor is there. His sword ran through the neck of the dredge. He is gone, says Ivor, looking over the boy's shattered skull. Alet grasps her hands to her mouth. I'm checking the other houses, even remarks. See if you can find anyone and then meet me at the Great Hall. Like market? Ooh, that's a, and we buy and we're buying Renault which Okay. Protection from death plus one strength, no button strength. No yeah. plus two strength, that seems nice. And let's get twenty-six full uh heroes. In here we can check items, yeah. And oh, we can promote him. Yeah, sure. Uh, this unit has points available to spend on improving stats. Okay, so I want you to be my tank. Wait, what's that? No, I wanted to see what that is. God damn it. Uh, okay, oh, it requires level 3, I guess. So we are not putting it on anyone. Right now, but I'm fairly sure it's going to either. You find anyone? A few. Send them inside. God, this is bad. About Jill, it was my fault. He was a good fighter for his age. No family. I for I've forgotten what it's like facing rage. I'm out of practice, Rook. Look, as long as I've known you, you've always wormed your way out of talking about rage. This would be the time to start talking. I can tell you they rarely stop for rest. The sooner we leave, the better. They'll follow us until we're tripping over tired women and children. Then they'll attack. Even after we're wiped out, they'll keep coming, trampling corpses in their wake. There's no end to them. How did anyone survive the Great Wars? Ask the Menders. I wasn't there. But I know you fought your fair share. Yeah, I've killed enough slack for one lifetime. That's why you're going to save us now. Don't lay that on me. Come on, let's get inside. Look, thank my gods you made it. The great hall is an utter den, filled as it is with dozens of terrified families. Don't stop roaring yet. I haven't! What in the depths is going on? Dredge milding around, ransacking houses? The chieftain's wife finds you, pushing through the crowd. They must know we are here. Why haven't they attacked? Don't know. I wouldn't expect it to last. I have made some decisions. But tell me straight, what would you both do in my place? I would have left by now. They're already outside the doors. Not so easily done, Rook. I trust Ivor on this. The 
Triften sighs a deep and heavy breath, slumping. He looks years older. I imagined us fighting back and saving the town, but nonsense. I was right, of course. <clears throat> we can't just wait to be slaughtered. Where do we go if threats are coming down from the north? Frostfell. To the west. It's close and it has walls. I intend to be free of Skorg in one push. Nobody left behind. I wouldn't. If they follow us, we're done. What do you suggest? Let me create a distraction. Then go. I'll catch up on the road to Frostvale. That sounds exactly like a suicide, but... Uh, what if we set the town on fire as we left? That is one thing I will not do. We will return here one day, whether I live to see it or not. Okay, so let me help Ivor create a distraction, the Chieftain thinks of for a long moment. I didn't ask for advice just to ignore it. Promise you're not throwing away your lives on this. That wasn't part of my plan. Ivor? Nope. Then I'm going with you. That catches you by surprise, the Chieftain wraps his chin but does, doesn't argue. From the training she's given a lift, you've no doubt she can handle a bow. Fine, I'll get the townspeople ready. Make your move, Ivor. We'll leave when you're clear. I'll let find you before you have a chance to find her. I know what you're doing. You have to let me come with you. Don't leave me. Please, I'll be good. Not this time, it's too dangerous. Don't leave me alone, she says, tears in her eyes. It's difficult. But you drag yourself to the door of the great hall, resolute that you're making the best decision for her. You step into the town courtyard, where you can already see dredge in every direction. Ivor starts banging his shields and swearing at them. We kill a few, he shouts, and the rest will follow. You steal yourself for a tough fight. Okay, so there, that's the. <laughs> we can't use all oh, that. Oh, bracelet because she has it on her soul. And the swing. Why are you so close? I do not appreciate. I would appreciate you sending that up uh, somewhere like this and like this. And you're uh, slightly back. Ready? God damn it! Yeah, okay, we need to move one, two, three tiles. One, two, three, over here. Yep. And oh my goodness. Okay, nope. I don't know how, but I was fairly sure I counted that right. Of course, he does that. No, he does simple health damage. All the rest does. Rain of Arrows. Okay. They will do armor. But the thing is, we need to keep, keep them safe, so pretty much like this. Uh, he's gonna make it. Well, it's not like he can do a lot. Ooh. That's gonna hurt, I suppose. No, just one. Okay, you have to hit him hard. <laughs> Oh no 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 no. Yeah and she No she doesn't she doesn't need to move back, that's good. Okay, I'm very sure he can manage it. Just as I'm sure she'll die. No, okay. He's done, oh, but he got the pillage. 
do it for free. And kill him. It could have gone better, that's for sure. Another on um, no, another promotion for either? He was promoted. You have no problem getting the dredge to fall. Things begin to look dicey, but you are eventually able to lose them in thick woods where they have difficulty keeping up. You climb to an overlook and wait for the caravan to appear. An hour later, Oddleaf is the first to spot them. There! She points to the road as you rejoin them. You can tell there was trouble. Some people wounded, other missing. Alette rushes to you, throwing her arms around your waist. You smile and hug her tightly. Dad, please, don't do that again, she says. Brave girl, this one, as one of, of the women from Skork. Chieftain would have died without her, she points to the back of the caravan. You find Oddleaf beside her husband, who is laid out in the car. Old fool, she says, got himself a prize for trying to fight back. She shows you his deep gut wound, but his life, nothing for it but to get to forest well. Continue on in silence, Alette's hand in your own. And I think that's a good part, place to end for now. Thank you very much, stay alive and see you soon. Bye!